Hey y'all, it's me, Simon Dragon. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, share the video. So, I'm going to go ahead and knock out the earth signs here. Let's start with Capricorn. What's going on for the Capricorns here? This is either past, future, or present energy. Past, future, or present energy. We got witness protection. January Capricorn. Mm, you came out with your own reading. So maybe you could be a witness protection right now. We have child support. Okay, for Capricorns, witness protection. January Capricorn coming out. And then we got child support coming out. Okay. So let's see what's going on. What's going on? What's happening? I'm going to start with these yellow cards. <clears throat> Is witness protection for the Capricorns. Witness protection for the Capricorns. We got thinking woman popping out. We also have um, the sun coming out. So somebody, you expose something, Capricorn. You expose something, or um, something. Something was exposed. Something was illuminated. Witness protection for the Capricorns. We got family. Then we got woman holding the heart. And then we have angel of strength. On the bottom of that, we got the heart chakra. So there's definitely something going on with them, with some family. Maybe something happened with some family. Um, maybe your family could be in witness protection right now. Or yeah, or yeah, you and your family could be in witness protection right now because of something that was illuminated. Um, and also because of, because of your strength, somebody, your, your, your strength, your strength, you could be experiencing some type of financial hardships right now, but this is also a part of the witness protection. This is, this is what the downside of being in witness protection, you're in witness protection, but you can't, you know, your money might be looking funny right now. And, but that's also in order to protect you in a way. So witness protection for the Capricorns, please. Witness protection, destiny. Witness protection for the Capricorns, destiny. Then we have authority. You have, you have a um a high you you're a witness protection. I don't know. You're a witness protection. We have destiny and authority because I feel like your destiny. You could be somebody who is a whistleblower. Maybe you're someone who, who stands up and says what needs to be said or does what needs to be done. And you do the hard things. You do the things that nobody else wants to do. And then we have wishes fulfillment. Fulfillment of wishes. So you standing up into your power and walking in your power is why you have witness protection. Why you have such an immense amount of protection that's surrounding you right now, Capricorn. Because of your destiny and what it is that you're meant to do, okay. And you also could be having, you also could have a lot of money that's coming towards you. So that's another reason why you're in witness protection, or your family could be in witness protection. Again, this is about something that's being said. Something that's being said is why you're in witness protection. For Capricorn. Or why whoever this is is in witness protection. Let's see. What's witness protection for the Capricorn? We have commitment. Strength. And then you have financial or career. Yeah, your commitment. I feel like your commitment to your to your as long as you stay committed to your career, whatever this is that you're invested in, whatever this is that you've made your career, your witness protection will continue to remain um, as long as you stay strong. As long as you stay strong, committed, and invested. Strong, committed, and invested. You you will remain and you will remain protected. Okay. There's two cards of strength here. Strength is very important. Right now for you, Capricorn, it's very important that you don't show no signs of weakness and allow space for healing. Because that's that's a part of your life purpose as well. We got two destiny cards here. 
your your life purpose involves you having this extra layer of a protection because of how how powerful you are right now, Capricorn. You're in a very powerful space. Let's see, what is January Capricorn? January Capricorn. Then we have a um, magician in a mirror. So there could be a Capricorn that's trying to manipulate a situation. Somebody could be trying to manipulate you or make you feel. Um, there were, there could, yeah, there could be somebody trying to manipulate your heart, manipulate your heart strings, um, pulling on your heart. But I feel like also healing your heart is a way to overcome whatever this manipulation is. Because there's a cycle that's closing out. Trust your intuition as this cycle closes out, January Capricorn. This is either a, with a January Capricorn or this is for a January Capricorn. Or, you know, there's something dealing with someone who's deceitful. I just saw deceit. And then we have indecision here. Indecision. So you might feel a little indecisive about it. But let's see, January Capricorn. Something's gonna, yeah, something's gonna come out to you. Goddess of the Moon, and then we have the Sun. Something's gonna be illuminated to you. Some type of illusion, something that was done in the dark, something that you don't see, something that you've been ignoring, something with this magician in the mirror. Somebody's been playing, playing, you know, playing in your energy or something. Yeah, somebody's playing in your energy behind the scenes and it's it's going to come to the surface for you you're going to see it very clear very plain yeah anxiety this person yeah you could this somebody's having anxiety right now about it because they know that this is is coming in yeah envy somebody envies you they envied you so they took action against you and um but know that you're protected no matter what you're still protected, even though this envious person came in and took action and they been trying to manipulate your energy to make you feel indecisive when it comes to your matters of your heart. Um, but you got you got this. You got this. Your protection's been amplified. January Capricorn. Because of whoever this is. January Capricorn. Got heartache and loss. There's yeah, there's so if you've lost anyone or lost or took any or had any spaces or times of heartache and heartbreak, that's gonna be balanced out too as well. Yeah, crown shocker. I feel like God's trying to guide you. Trust what trust what you trust what you feel and hear in your in your um in your I wanna say in your dream state. But also, I just saw disruption, so there could be a need for a crown, a crown chakra cleansing. So there could be a need for a crown chakra cleansing because of the manipulation here with the magician in the mirror, with somebody who's trying to. Um, I I just had to tear apart your heart. Somebody trying to tear apart your heart, trying to break your heart in half with conflict and defeat. Conflict and defeat. And look, and their heart shock on the bottom of the deck. I'm telling you, somebody's trying to tear apart your heart. They're trying to break down your heart space. Because, yeah, they're trying to break down your heart space, Capricorn. Yeah, so emotionally, emotional withdrawal. So the best way to, and then there's communication here. So there's a communication and emotional withdrawal. So the best way would be to just, the best way to overcome this is to pull back your emotions. Okay, someone somebody has to pull out, pull their emotions up out of the situation, and kind of like, because something. Look, you got you, there's communication. Either you're going to be given communication, or you will receive communication about something that's coming. It's coming to light. It's coming to light. Okay, something is coming to light. Anything else right for January Capricorn? And then we have spiritual union. Stand your ground. Spiritual union and stand your ground. So stand your ground here. You and your partner or whoever this is that you um, have a spiritual connection with. It, there's a need to stand your ground in this, in this relationship. Stand your ground. And then we have truth. The truth, it, the truth will be illuminated. 
the truth will be illuminated. But you gotta pull your emotions out of it. Don't get too caught up in the emotional side of it all, Capricorn. Just drop the emotions. Capricorn, January, Capricorn. January Capricorn for the Capricorn. Empowerment. You're going through this. You're going through this so that it can help you to further empower yourself and others. Um, and like I said, there's money coming in. That's why your protection is so high. You got prosperity, answers, empowerment. Then we have prosperity. Maybe that this is a part of your story. This part of your story right here that you're going through is going to bring you in a lot of prosperity. Okay, we have answers. Answers and new beginnings. So it's time to start something new, Capricorn. Something new. Going in a new direction. But it involves you accepting the truth. We have truth here and grieving. So accepting the truth, walking in your truth, embracing the truth, grieving and releasing here. Because that's what's going to give you the empowerment that you need. But the conflict, maybe there's conflict here. <sighs> maybe it's like a need to push, pull back emotionally because the emotions is what's causing the conflict. But if you pull back emotionally and actually look at the facts of what it is, you'll be able to start over in a new way. You'll be able to move forward in a new way. But you got to just look at it for what it is. All right, so child support for the Capricorns. Child support for the Capricorns, please. First child support. We got contract. Contract. So some some somebody deceit. So there's some type of deceitful energy when it comes to child support. There's a contract. Somebody could be being getting put on child support. Capricorn. Either you get put on child support or they or you're about to put somebody on child support. And you, or yeah. The sun here. So the sun. Something's being something's being brought to the surface. Something's definitely being illuminated with child support. I feel like this is going this and then we have the door to door to personal the door to romance and we have action. Um Mm, what is this story of romance? Maybe somebody could be coming in to give you support with your child. And this could be a romantic partner. And this partner, yeah, door to personal healing and happiness. Trust your intuition here with the third eye chakra. So maybe somebody could be coming in to give you support with your children. Capricorn. Cornucopia. Yeah. Blossom in abundance. Yeah. You got a lot of money coming in. A lot of money coming in, a lot of a lot of love coming in as well. So it's money and love at the same time, Capricorn. And this is going to, this is going to help you with your children and with your child. This is your this is going to come in and as a form of child support. Like the this could be this could be emotional support. You know that you know if you get into a relationship and this person you know they ended up falling in love with you, they fall in love with your children. That's support. You know, then, then they start giving money and, and financial help or whatever. That's cornucopia, blossom in abundance. That's everything. That's that's child support. Somebody's about to get some um, amazing child support. And a child support that comes as in more than just monetary. Okay? Universal support. With partnerships and alliances. The universe is supporting you and your children. Let's see, what is for the Capricorn's child support? The universe is uh, moving in your favor. Yeah, because it's something that you're creating for the sacral chakra. Maybe it's something that you created. Maybe it's the fact that, you know, you're finding a way. And yeah, maybe somebody could be getting, somebody else could be getting pregnant or something. 
this could result in a pregnancy, a birth of some sort. It doesn't actually have to be in an actual baby, but it could be um, definitely something that you're working on creating that's going to bring in balance. Okay, it's going to bring in a lot of balance here. This is facing your fears, addressing your addressing your fears, and sacred chakra could also be dealing with guilt, shame. Um, things like that. Yeah, material harvest. So, yeah, that's actually pretty, that's a pretty good one there. Not a bad idea. But something, I feel like you and someone else could come together and create something that, um, that brings in a lot of money. And it could be um, involving, it could be involving children. Like maybe you and someone else could get together and work with children or, or provide for children in some type of way, provide support for children. And that could bring in a lot of abundance. Clarify child support for the Capricorns. And we have beauty and good luck. Yeah, so you guys see the beauty in it all. Okay, I feel like this is something, this is something that only you can do. Only you and whoever this is that's coming towards you can do. You're going to have a lot of good luck here. Because you got, you are, your willpower, it outweighs the conflict and the defeat, Capricorn. New beginning, yeah. New beginning and injustice. You got a new beginning coming in. Good luck is on your side. Justice is here. And you gotta forgive, forgive whoever this is that's been lacking. Forgive whoever this is that's been coming in trying to manipulate the situation. Forgive them. Yeah, protection, talent, and protection. It's like two people are coming together, or so you, you, so somebody. It could be two people. It could just be one person. It could be a. A blending of energies within self. But either way, you got good luck coming in. You got good luck right now. And then there's good luck because there's this new beginning coming with something that you're about to create. And it happens to go hand in hand with romance and child support. So romance and children, talent and psychic abilities. You could be, you could have a talent for seeing, seeing through stuff or something like that. Maybe you have a talent. Just trust your, your your intuition, okay? And then you got family here. So you have family support. You're going to have more family support. And this could come in a form of family members who are not actual blood. And then we got forgiveness. I see forgiveness and grieving. Grieving. You got for in order to for, in order to lighten your load, you got to let it go. You got to feel it and let it go. Okay, it's set clear boundaries, Capricorn. Anything else? Confidence, closure. Yeah, have the confidence to close, close out these cycles. Close out these cycles that no longer serve you. And, okay, guys. So, yeah, that is what I have for y'all. Y'all go ahead and like, share, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one, Capricorn. Bye.